In this video, we will walk you through the first steps of getting started with Reach RS2. Reach RS2 goes in a carry case with a strap. The package also contains LoRa antenna, USB-C cable, and user guide. Before you start, check the battery level of your Reach RS2. Press the power button once to display the current power level. If it's low, charge the device from a USB wall charger or a power bank. Let's power Reach on and update the firmware. In order to do that, you need Reach RS2 itself. Wi-Fi network with internet access and a smartphone or tablet to connect to the receiver. In this video, we use smartphone, but the process is the same for all other devices. Use the sticker on top of Reach to install the ReachView app on your iOS or Android device before updating. Next, turn on your Reach RS2. Hold the power button for 3 seconds until all the LEDs light up, showing that Reach is turned on. Wait until the Wi-Fi LED turns white. That means Reach is in hotspot mode and broadcasting Wi-Fi. Connect to Wi-Fi using your smartphone. The network is called Reach. After you've successfully connected, launch Reach View app. You'll see the list of available Reach devices. Press on Reach to get into settings. This is the Reach View updater. Press the plus button and enter your Wi-Fi network name, security type, and password. Both the name and password are case sensitive, so make sure you enter everything correctly. When you're done, press the save button and Reach will remember this Wi-Fi network. Press on the added network and then connect. Reach RS2 will stop broadcasting Wi-Fi and will connect to your network. Make sure that your mobile device is connected to the same Wi-Fi network as well. Solid blue network LED on Reach RS2 stands for a successful connection to a Wi-Fi network. Reach RS2 is in client mode. Now you can open Reach View again and refresh the list of devices. Press on Reach to get into settings. Click Update Reach View. This process may take several minutes. When the update is done, press the Reboot button. After reboot, wait for Wi-Fi LED to turn blue, showing that Reach RS2 has joined your network again. Swipe right to get back to the list of devices, then refresh the list and click Reach. You will see the filling MLID logo indicating Reach View app is loading. Your Reach RS2 is ready for work. Do the same with all other units. Thanks for watching.